Magic Earth. Come join us as we adventure along the nature. So buckle your seatbelts because you're in for a bumpy ride. Nature Trail. Looks like we found our path. Wow, I can't wait to go on this nature trail. <laughs> this is snakeskin. Snakes can shed their skin from up to three times a year. Now that is what I call a spawny. This is a spruce tree. They help us breathe. And you know it's a spruce tree because the needles lie flat. <sighs> this is a dogwood tree. Ruff, ruff. <laughs> up in the Bruce Peninsula, we live on limestone. It may look like Swiss cheese, but the holes in the rock are actually called pitting. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. These, These trees, trees are, are called poplars. They grow in big clumps and very quickly. And beavers love to chew on these guys because they're very soft. So I, I guess, guess you could, could say, say they're, they're pretty popular. Money. What? When water's clean, we drink it. And creatures live in it. They use it to lay eggs, and they bury themselves in the mud. Or, or the animals, animals can, can use it as a mating ground. <laughs> this is a rubber boot print, and this is a raccoon print. You can tell by the opposable thumbs. Sneaky little buggers, aren't they? We are in the wetlands. Behind me there is a beaver dam. Damn! And in the, in the middle there is a lodge created by the one and only, the beaver. This stick was cut by a beaver. You can tell by the odd, the unique ridges and the odd angle. Some people don't like beavers because they flood their lands. But animals love the beavers, beavers because they create a new home for them. Examples of these animals are turtles and crocodiles, fish and frogs, water snakes and ducks. The only way you can get into the beaver lodge is if, you, is if you go under them. That's the only entry hole. Beavers are really b busy at night building their new homes. Woo! We got beaver fever! Is this tree naked? But it has comb. This is a tamarack tree. It's the only carnivorous tree that leaves with its leaves in the winter. Oh. <laughs> are you suffering from scurvy? Yes. I don't just look and help you. These cedar leaves are full of vitamin C that you can boil and put in tea. It'll make you feel better. I see the light. What? Great trip, eh girls? You oh, betcha! Yeah. Did you like what you saw? If so, put on your rubber boots. Find a trail. And get going. Cause, Cause nature's fun. And it's ready, ready for you to explore. Woo! Uh, yes.